the truth is that culture is always evolving. Mm-hmm. And you can talk about love without talking about culture. Because um, it's nobody has ever seen love. Like, you cannot say, this is love. Like, you want to show me love. With my, mm. I want to see it with my eyes. No? So, um, it's something that is expressed and something that is perceived. You know? So, and this perception of love has to do with culture, generally. Mm. If culture is evolving, it's constantly evolving, the way we perceive love, the way we express love, will also keep evolving. You know? And, you know, we are at a phase where there is... Um, there is an interchange of of um, of culture. You understand? Just as we keep on exporting and importing religion, we keep um, government keeps changing education. We keep um, studying together. We keep um, the media is also um, a very important culture shaper. Also, so um, we get to view the media. So um, I watch Z World, for instance, and I begin to see how they express love and all that. So. It's 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 understandable that the way we perceive love, the way we express love, will keep evolving as culture keeps evolving. There is no way we are going to. There's no way we, we are going to express love the way our parents did, and there's no way our kids are going to express love the way we we do express love today, right? I I feel like uh, love is. Love is very, like I said earlier, it's very different for different people and different cultures and different times. I feel like, you know, the love that I actually, you know, value a lot is the one that is not expressed verbally. So I prefer the love that, you know, that's shown through action. Okay. You know, and so that's the love that I prefer. And I also think that love that is expressed, I love you, I love you. I don't really have a lot of value for it. I think it's a it's a Western value, and nothing is wrong with having nothing wrong with being Western. But I just don't see the value because I've seen situations where someone tells you "I love you" right now, and then they do something that is opposite that shows that you know they just said so. It's, so I just feel like it's a it's a sensational feeling of the moment mm. that can change. That is not selfless. That is not, that is not, um, that is not unconditional. That is, okay. that, that comes with a contract. If you do this, I don't love you no more. If you do right. that, I don't love you no more. So I don't, so for me personally, I just don't really, you know, it doesn't mean anything much to me. When I hear I love you, I hear, when I hear it, it doesn't ring a bell to me. It doesn't, you know. I prefer the love that, you know, I see it, I feel it, I know it's there. Okay. Yeah. Okay, okay so, um, so, Lydia, should I, so, what will you say about someone who is not, um maybe it's not speaking love to you, it's not expressing it properly. This person is actually expressing this love, like, you see him act or her act it out towards you today. And tomorrow, they are no longer acting it out to you the way they did yesterday, so... What will you say about that? It's they didn't do it properly this time. It's, but but yeah, the, I will not realize changed, something that the, changed. I will not realize that the love is not there anymore. I realize that's a problem. And if it's something we can work on, then work on it. If it's something that you know, I realize it's a problem. Now then, I will know that you know that I will feel it. And I would, and you know, if I actually love the person, or if the person's love really means something to me, then I will approach it and want to get an understanding. As to why these things are not is no longer I want to I want to be on the same page as the person, meaning that I want to know you know what's going on and you know is there anything that you know can be done to fix this issue? There's nothing. That's okay. I mean, just at least I would at that point, and that's really, really the love that I know. So if you're still acting, I feel it. You tell me you love me, you love me out there, and you stop telling me, it's not going to bother me. If you wake up in the morning and say, I love you, and blah, 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 every morning you wake up and say, I love you, it's just going to be like a national anthem to me. It's going to be like <laughs> that ring one that you, your cell phone goes off. And the day you stop saying it, I'm not going to ask you, why did you stop saying it? Well.